In Syscad, to change the name of a unit, if you right click on the unit, so if we right click with our mouse button, we get what we call the access window. And near the top of the access window, there's this button, which is tag. So if I click on that button, I get the change tag dialog box. The old tag is shown at the top and the new tag is shown in blue down here. So this will replace the tag. If I just start typing the name, and in this case it's conch acid, if I type conch and I have put it, if I put a space in and I type acid and then enter or click on the OK button, and you'll see the unit has now been changed to conch acid. If I want to change the position of a tag or the size of a tag, I can click up here on this icon, which is Tag Position Show or Hide, or I can click on Graphics, Edit, Tag Position Show or Hide, and I will get this dialog box. Or I can say Hide All Unit Tags, and you'll see there, they're all now hidden, but I actually want to display them, so I'll click back on Show All. And at the moment, you'll see all my links do not have their tags displayed, and if I say Show All Link Tags, You'll see now all the tags are displayed. I can also use the in window or cross in window to show or to hide all tags within a window. I can change the size of the tags or the rotation and I can show or hide individual tags. To change a tag's position, up here there's set tag position. If I click on that, you'll see it actually makes the dialog box smaller and now I can go and change the tag positions. So the first thing it says is which unit do I want? And you click on a unit and it'll go magenta. And then it'll allow you to place the position of that tag. And you can just click to show it where you want it to be. And when you've finished, you can say next. And then it changes back to blue. And now you can click on your next unit, which in this case is the autoclave. If I click there, I can change its position by just clicking. That's where the bottom left of the name of the tag.